How's it going guys? This is Credence from Team High Society and uh, bringing a quick review or some troubleshooting with you tonight. Um, so I'm going to one of the little Maytech uh, 5 volt and 12 volt backs here. It's a little all-in-one that kind of fits. It's the same profile that the uh, Nase 32 fits. And uh, Ajax and I have been running this on a couple of our quads and it ran into a really interesting problem. So the uh, usually I run a a 4S battery and then the VTX I run a 12 volt line to it. it hasn't been a problem except for under hard pulls we've lost video this has happened on two different quads uh, on one of those quads we swapped the backs out or swapped this actual board out here and um, just so you can re for reference here this is the actual main tech board and get the baggie here from uh, FPV model and uh, so anyways I've got it set up uh, I've been able to actually replicate the issue so during flight on a hard pull we lose video and this can be with a brand new full battery we've run a tattoo battery a pulse battery um, a hobby king battery none of them matter under a full pull on a quad even with a fresh battery we've get a, a, a drop in the voltage and then the back just dies on you and you lose all your VTX so anyways let me show you the rig here um, back up so you can see that I'm you know, the, the setup here is pretty legit. So I've got my multimeter running, power supply going, um, never mind the uh, soldering station. But um, so here on the back thing, it zoomed in. We've got the uh, 12 volt soldered shot here. So we should be getting 12 volt uh, on the positive line and negatives common. And the multimeter showing 11.94 volts, no big deal. Everything looks good. I'm running 14.8, which is simulating a full battery on 4S. And so what, what's gonna happen here is when the voltage drops down to about 13.9, 13.8, all of a sudden the Beck dies. So I'll take it down kind of quick here and then we'll slow down right when we get to 13. So I'm at 13.9 and I've managed to kill the back. So we're at 3.88 volts, 8.7. Um, and at this point, on three volts, your, your VTX is dead. You have no video coming back. So we've, we've managed to crash a couple quads because of this. Now let's say I've let off the throttle, voltage returns, it doesn't matter how high it gets. We'll go back up to 14.8 here. And the back is officially offline. At the same time, you can notice here that the 12 volt LED has dimmed quite a bit. And never actually comes back. So uh, one of the easiest, the only way to solve this and the only way to reset it is to actually pull the power on the battery. So we'll, we'll pull the battery here, go back up, get a solid 11.94, everything's up and running again and as soon as she goes down into the 13.9, 13.8 range, it's dead again. Okay, so something else that's really interesting Set at 14.8, I'm gonna kill the power here. Now, if this power supply ramps up, or as it ramps up when it first powers on, because it's not immediately 14.8 and it's below that 13.9 range, the Beck never actually comes up at 12 volts. And I can replicate that every time. So this time we'll just pull the battery and immediately it gets hit with, um, or power supply I'm calling the battery here so we're good at 11.94 turn that off and this is just the back bleeding down never actually restores so anyways uh, interesting issue with the Matex I'm curious if anyone else is running into this and since this We've been able to replicate this on two different quads with three different backs. Uh, one of them has actually been replaced with maybe four backs now. Um, I'm officially abandoning this board. I, it's got the same problem on every one of them we've tried. So uh, if you guys have had the same issue, please leave uh, comments below. And uh, other than that, like and subscribe and we'll bring more videos like this. Hope the new year is good to you guys. Have a good one.